Hello friends, welcome back. Today we've got a Walmart grocery delivery for you. It is Saturday afternoon. We spent just under $70, I believe. I will go ahead and insert the meal plan here for you and then jump into the groceries. All right, so in the back we've got a gallon of milk for cereal for Will and the kids. I'm currently dairy-free, so I have oat milk on hand. A box of Triscuits for cheese and herb. They did have a $1 rebate back on Ibotta, so I do still use Ibotta. Um, so I'll get a dollar back on that, which made this like a $1.28. Will wanted some more of the Quaker Caramel Rice Crisp, so I got a bag of those. Bag of Great Value Cantina Style Tortilla Chips. We've got some Cara Cara oranges. My friend Lauren was like obsessed with them recently and so it made me want to also get some. The kids probably won't eat it. They're weird about fresh oranges. They don't like the pith, the white part. And so unless I get it like all off, which is insane and I don't have time for that, um, they won't eat it. So they do canned oranges, which you'll see in a moment. A head of iceberg lettuce. I've been using this for tuna wraps and like lunch meat wraps. Um, and the kids use it for salad. Cilantro for taco night. Tennessee Pride Mild Country Sausage for Breakfast Burritos. Cajun Style and Dewey Smoked Sausage for the Cowboy Stew. Some Grey Poupon Country Dijon Mustard, the coarse ground mustard. I wanted the regular kind. I had it at Jeff and Lauren's house recently on a sandwich and it was really good. I had never had Grey Poupon, believe it or not. But um, they didn't have like just the regular, so I'm hoping that the, ground, the coarse ground mustard is just as good. Honey Barbecue Sauce. Jackson really likes this with like his chicken nuggets or basically chicken nuggets um, and like regular chicken when I do chicken breast in the pressure cooker he'll just he likes to dip his chicken in this some Clausen dill pickles both the kids and I love these we go through them very quickly a can of diced green chilies for the cowboy stew I ordered just a one pound bag of the great value mozzarella cheese they were out so they gave us a 32 ounce bag which is fine um Will just uses this to doctor up frozen pizzas on pizza night. He likes to add extra cheese to it. Some um, sea salt, um, seaweed for Alice and I, but Alice really likes the seaweed snacks, which she's like, I have such a weird, you know, I'm so weird for a kid. I like seaweed. And I was like, well, good for you. So she does like those. For pizza night for Will and the kids, on Wednesday nights, I have small group Bible study, so I'm out of the house, so they get to enjoy pizza. Again, I'm dairy-free, so I'm not doing cheese right now. I don't know when I'm going to introduce things back. I've had little traces of dairy here and there, um, and they kind of give me a headache. I don't get digestive issues, but I find that I have a headache. Anyway, ordered a great value pepperoni rising crust pizza. They were out. They subbed it for the DiGiorno pepperoni, which we'll, we'll be thankful for. He likes the DiGiorno, but we typically won't pay for the price of that. The kids each have a microwavable cheese. Well, Alice has cheese, Jackson has pepperoni. They really like these little three minute pizzas from Great Value. Um, I, so that's what we get and we'll eat that. Black beans for, I think I got them for taco night, maybe? I was gonna do some black beans because I'm gonna do taco bowl for myself and so I was really gonna just load it up like they do at Chipotle um, with like black beans and rice and all sorts of stuff. Uh, in the back, some Alexia crinkle cut sweet potato fries. When we were at Lauren's house recently, she made the waffle fries by Alexia. Sorry, my phone keeps going off. Hold on. Uh, it's Will texting me and he's blowing my phone up. That's what the beep is. We had the waffle cut fries at her house and Jackson really liked them. So I was like, well, maybe he'll eat these. They didn't have the waffle style at Walmart. So um, I just got the crinkle cut. So we'll see. They'll probably be really good in the air fryer. Two cans of mandarin oranges. I will open a can and it's good for the kids for like a side item for lunch or dinner. So one can will usually last about two meals for the two of them. So I got two cans of that. Like I said, I'll be eating fresh ones. Will would also eat these and the kids will go for the frozen, or frozen, the canned ones. Um, frozen corn and frozen sweet pea, great value brand for I'm assuming it's for the cowboy stew. I haven't looked at the recipe since I made my grocery order, so I'm kind of forgetting, but I think it's for the cowboy stew. Frozen buttermilk pancakes for the kids. Great quick breakfast item for them. Four pack of chunk light tuna for myself. I've been doing, like I said, tuna wraps and um, tuna, like 
So I'll use either the low carb wraps and make it an actual wrap, or I'll make like a little bit of tuna salad and then use iceberg lettuce and put it in there and like kind of roll it up in that. Two cans of kidney beans for cowboy stew. Um, some soy sauce because we're getting low and we're doing chicken stir fry this week. So two bags of stir fry veggies. I usually mix it up. So this is the sugar snap, sugar snap pea stir fry. And this is the deluxe stir fry. So it has some of the same veggies, but gives a variety. Um, some plain old cheap white bread for sandwiches for Will and the kids. And then I ordered a 30 count of the Goody Ouchless hair ties because Alice and I, and Will now, because he pulls his hair back, he's growing it out, he'll pull it back. He shaves the sides. If you've seen him in vlogs lately, you know what I'm talking about. Um, he'll pull it back at work sometimes though. But they, did, they were out of the 30 count, so they just gave me two of the 15 count, which is fine. And that, my friends is everything for this grocery haul this week. We have all the other ingredients needed on hand. Um, so yeah, drop a comment, share some love, and until next time, we will see you later. Bye.